Get your credit back in the groove. Get your credit back in the groove. Get your credit back in the groove. Got you through the process, no way you can lose. Why, uh, hello everyone. This is Uncle James here with another awesome video. Now, in this video, we're going to look at what personal information needs to be included in your dispute letters, okay? What personal information needs to be included. So let's go ahead and jump right into this. Okay, the first thing you need to make sure that you have is your full name. Okay, you need your full name, uh, date of birth, and your social security number. <clears throat> now, the reason this information is required is they need to verify your identity. Okay, they need to make sure that you are who you say you are. Okay, now what other items are required? Okay, the fourth thing that is there, you need proof of your current address. Okay, you need proof of your current address, and then the address is where you live within the last two years. Because what happens is this, the information that they retrieve uh, about you is all based on your address, okay? So they need, to, they need to verify the address and they also need your current address. Okay, number five, they also need a copy of a government-issued ID. They need a copy of a government-issued <clears throat> ID. Now this ID could be a driver's license, it could be a military ID card, or it could be a state ID, okay? <clears throat> but it needs to be government issued. And then number six, uh, they need a copy of a utility bill, a bank statement, or uh, insurance statement. Again, this is to verify your identity and to also verify your address, all right? Now, success leaves clues. Keep in mind success leaves clues. You need to make sure that you do not have any zero days, all right? A zero day is where you do absolutely nothing within that day to accomplish your goal, okay? You want every day, every day, every day, you want to do something that leads you towards accomplishing your goal. It doesn't matter what the goal is. This is the only way you will have massive success is by taking massive action you must become a person of action you must also have a good pma positive mental attitude some examples are i am designed for greatness there is greatness within i can do all things i am more than a conqueror all things work together for my good. These are examples of some positive affirmations, some positive uh, <clears throat> mind uh, affirmations, some positive self-talk. Okay, these are things you have to have. You must become a person and take massive action, and you must feel good about yourself and have a good, positive self-esteem. There's just no way around it. These are absolutes. Now, let me speak this blessing over you. Until we meet again, may the Lord continue to bless you. May he smile upon you. May he grant you his favor. And may he continue to give you his peace. And may he also continue to enlarge your territory. This has been Uncle James. Have a great day. Take care now. Get your credit back in the groove. Get, Get your credit back in the groove. Get your credit back in the groove. Guide you through the process, no way you can lose.